Hello guys, welcome back to Stroll with me. I hope you all are doing well and you are healthy. So today I'm gonna take you to my new apartment and I'm gonna give you the empty apartment tour. So you will get an idea how apartments are handovered in uh, Germany, um, especially in Berlin. Um, so you will see like there will be literally nothing inside the apartment and I'm gonna tell you very important points like what uh, things you need to take care when you take the handover of the keys of your um, new rented apartment so yeah I'm 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 ready now and I'm going to like uh, start uh, in a, like around five minutes today it's uh, it's very bright here but today I must tell you um, it's not like really um, uh, a good weather day because um, today it's not sunny it's showing rain all day and I'm just afraid that you know I have many things to do today um, some sh shifting and stuff and picking up some furniture pieces so I am not sure how this weather gonna support me today in doing all of that but yeah anyhow um, let's go now I'm gonna uh, move out of my home in uh, five to ten minutes and then I'm gonna give you home tour so stick with me okay guys i'm standing uh, in front of my apartment door and yeah this is my apartment and i live on third floor um and yeah i'm excited to show you let's go inside this is the entrance actually it's an old building so we have this like a big royal door <laughs> and yeah i am inside now And if I enter, you will see a hallway here. It's a long hallway. So this is entirely a hallway. And yeah, this was the main door. And if I go left from the hallway, you see there is a storage room here. So this one is the storage room. Just in front of the front door, you will also see a bathroom. So this is the bathroom. We got this bathroom and it is really big enough. This is shower area. And this is a heater. So it is really very important to have a heater in your bathroom because it will help you to, you know, dry a lot of your clothes, uh, use towels, etc. And here, here is the basin. Basically, it's a 2.5 Zimmer house. So in Berlin, um, you will always, you know, include your living room as well. So according to India, it's proper on BHK with a storage room. And here, this is a bedroom. The bedroom is quite um, big enough for two people. So I have also plenty of light. And then let's move towards the living room. So this is the living room. So again, it's a really very big living room. I like my living room and I'm also gonna make the living room uh, into a partition so that I can make a dining area here. So somewhere here I will get the dining area and here um, we will um, have sofa. And now 
As you see, it's not spring, it's not summer. This is outside of my apartment. I don't have a balcony, unfortunately. But you know, when I just get down of the apartment, I see a big supermarket. So that is a railway you already might have known. This is the, you know, uh, one of the supermarket chain in um, Berlin, in Germany. So yeah, this is outside of my apartment. Now moving towards the kitchen. Kitchen is separate. And yeah, this is the kitchen. And this is her which is electrical stuff here we basically get always this induction stuffs but not the gas ones and this is grill and this is sink you will get um hot water as you see the up points blue and red so it's for hot water and cold water this has been provided by the owner already so yeah so just to uh, remind you one more time if you have not seen my video on um, how to set up a kitchen in berlin what is the kitchen funda here so basically i just want to highlight you um, if you are moving into an empty apartments then you can definitely ask your owner for a herd and also for a wash machine because they are you know i heard that it is obligatory to provide you this uh, two things even though if you get a very empty apartment as you have already seen the house um, so this is how you get uh, the empty apartment here in germany so now coming to some of the important points when uh, the day of handover of your apartment when you uh, get the keys make sure that you inspect all the apartment if your heaters are working if your uh, electricity is up and running if um, your uh, you know the things that they have provided if they have provided you electric stuff if they have provided you um, the basin if the water connection is properly working so make sure that the things are working everything including if there is something in the bathroom your bells your doors so make sure that you uh, check everything first thing and the second thing is make sure that you take at least three keys like the three set of keys um, because one will be with you one will be if any partner is living with you it will be with them and the another one is for a safer side that you always leave inside the home or yeah i suggest to always leave it inside the home so these are the three keys if you lose the key there will be high penalties just make sure that you don't lose the keys this is the second point that i want to tell you and the third point is when you take the apartment it is very common in germany that you have to pay for your electricity okay so you want um, uh, you i mean your owner won't pay for your electricity unless until it's a service apartment so you have to pay for your electricity um, and you have to make an electricity contract um, so usually when you take the apartment they will tell you two two rents one is cold rent one is warm rent so cold rent is like the net apartment rent the warm rent is including your water and the heating so usually there there are heaters for the apartment to heat up your apartment during winter times also during the spring times because it's really really cold in spring as well so yeah it is very important that you also check your heaters and um, yeah you will have this two rents so one one is warm rent and the uh, and then this cold rent so um, when you sign the contract they, the warm rent is included so your owner is paying for your heating and also water and uh, the uh, water uh, yeah basically water cold water and the hot water and the electricity you have to make contract with the electricity company and you have to get your own electricity contract and these are the three very important points that i want to uh, tell you when you uh, take a handover of the empty apartment i think there is nothing much that you have to bother about and the wi-fi of course the owner is not going to provide you the wi-fi so you have to take the wi-fi uh, by your own so you have to make contract also with the wi-fi um, i mean the the network provider so make sure that you just uh, take note of this 
so these are the things that you uh, need to remember so i hope you uh, like this video uh, and you like the empty apartment tour and you have noted all this uh, four points the basic four points that i told you if you have any questions definitely don't hesitate to leave your comments in the comment box and also you can um, message me on my insta and facebook i have given you the links below in the description i hope you like this video and keep following me because i'm gonna make more videos of my shifting process and i'm gonna give you many important tips in this whole shifting process how to make it like easier so do not forget to subscribe and yeah keep uh, giving your love keep sending your love and yeah take care guys see you again in my next video bye